I hear the name of Jesus Christ a lot, but it often is spoken without any real belief or conviction. It isn't the name that brings freedom, it's faith in the name, as Peter mentioned in today's verse. That being said, the misuse of Jesus' name can cause us to forget how special it really is. When people around me swear by using the name of Jesus, I tend to accept the person as they are and treat them with love because they just don't understand how precious Jesus is. But when I was younger, one guy I worked with who seemed to thrive on pushing people's buttons started swearing by using the name of Jesus constantly because he could tell that it bothered me. After putting up with it for a long time, I finally asked him to stop. Not surprisingly, he responded with, I'll say what I want. After thinking about it for a minute, I asked him what his girlfriend's name was. Then, every time something went wrong, I used his girlfriend's name in a tone that clearly expressed my displeasure. At first, he just looked at me sideways, but after a while, it started to bother him too. When I thought he had had enough, I proposed a truce. I agreed to stop using his girlfriend's name if he stopped using Jesus' name. We had a laugh, shook on it, and never looked back. Now, I'm not saying that you should confront everyone who misuses Jesus' name, but we need to reignite our awe for and trust in all that Jesus' name represents. Today, take some time to meditate on what His name means to you. Tune in tomorrow for more Devoted with Leon.